Well, hello. Lisa Scola, executive leader with Avon here, and um, I just wanted to kind of come out and give you, this thing's in the way, I'm sorry, give you a quick video on how I'm going to put together my um, New Year's sample packets that we're starting. Now, I don't take credit for this idea of all, because like I've told you a million times, there are so many smarter, smarter reps out there that come up with these cute things, and um, Paula actually is where I got the idea from, not sure who she got it from, or if this was her idea, um, something that I did used to to do just in like the orders when um, didn't have a sample that I wanted my customers to try to make my own so that I wasn't real new to that but I do like the idea of using network marketing in our Facebook and any other kind of um, um, vehicle out there that you like Twitter or Instagram or whatever to engage different people that may not be buying off you right now they might see that you sell Avon they may not buy Avon from you they're not interested in getting on your website you know you just don't know how to get them to come to you so this is a great idea and I did not have time at the end of last year to get it started with everything else the clothes that I had going on so I'm doing it starting January so as of yesterday, I put the post up and I did say I would like to take the first five. Now the reason why I started with the first five is because I don't want to spend a million dollars doing this. I just want to put a little bit of an investment in, see how it goes, get used to doing it, and then I can allow more or maybe people will drop off and then I'll pick up the one. So I have like five, seven people that I wrote down that are not customers of mine right now that don't buy from me currently and not much, they don't even live around me, which is kind of cool. So what you want to do is you would like to get some envelopes. Now I'm getting these envelopes um, because I'll buy them in the bulk, you know, and, and they're a little padded, so they have a little bit for their name and address. That's what I'm going to use to mail them in. Can't give you a cost on that yet because I haven't mailed any of them, but I'm going to assume that it's going to cost me a couple dollars. Everybody's like, what am I going to put in it? I'm going to do a campaign ahead. I plan on mailing them one time a month. So the beginning of the month, whatever campaign we're putting in, that's not really what I'm going to promote. I want to kind of gear towards that next one. So I'm gearing towards campaign three, which is nice because we still have time that if you haven't taken advantage of the demo for two, if you're putting your order in, you can still order out of this, which this is what the front of the book looks like that they're going to get because they're getting a campaign three brochure. So I'll have their campaign three brochure in there and I'm going to promote an item or items that are in that. And as I looked through it, what I'd like to promote is of course the very new fragrance that we have coming out. What's nice is you can get that, buy three, get one free. So the, um, the uh, ultra sexy heart, which is the ultra sexy with the heart that's coming out, it's being introduced in this campaign, awesome. Buy three, get one free. So I want to give them enough so they can try it every single day for at least a week. So they're going to have at least five samples. So the way these are with six on a sheet, they'll get one full sheet. So I'll give them one full sheet of these and explain that this is one for each day so that they can try it every day when they're out. And um, skincare is all going on sale. So I want to start promoting them. Now I don't have any skincare samples. Um, full packets of like the new ultimate which is what I'd like to promote I do have some of the serum ones here I'm going to give them a full size serum trial in there as well and what I will do is I would suggest you if you haven't already I stock up on these little spatulas they're in the sales tools department I'll put the number up for you great to have there's 25 I think in here I literally give these to my customers in their skincare orders. So when they order them, I put this right on the top because all of us women who have nails don't like digging our fingers down in there or this is nice, nice little, this is just a little trinket, you know, so they can get in there and they don't have to get it all underneath their nails. But I, I would suggest getting some of these because this is going to make it easier on you. When you're making samples, buy some little cute cups somehow that have a lid on them. You can get them in the bulk store, craft store departments that come in different sizes and whatnot. But once you have them, what makes it really nice is you buy full-size products off these demos a lot cheaper. And like what's like, for instance, the Mark, this body butter does not come in us. I mean, when you get this and you use it, it, this is wonderful stuff. And they don't have samples of it, so we have to make our own. So what I'll make a label to put on the front of the cup. I will open up the full size, of course this is mine and I use it and this is the cranberry. You know, use your little thing, scoop out a bunch, fill this up about, you know, with some good scoops, put the lid on it and stick it in. I would actually put it in another baggie. 
on top of it in case it were to break or bust in there. You don't want it to get all inside that envelope. And then you have um, put on there what it is. So that's what they're gonna get. Now they're not going to get this body butter in my sample pack at this time. They're gonna get some anew, but I have full size products of like the day cream. So I may do that or I may add it to my order now because I'm not mailing them out till the first. So they're gonna get a new. They're gonna get enough to use for a week. So I'll give them the whole package of samples. They're also going to get a whole sheet of the Ultra Sexy. Use your demos and, and get stuff out of here that is gonna save you money if you're using it to sample. I wrote everybody down on a piece of paper. I'm gonna keep them charted online. What I sent them, the date that it went out. Then when they get their book, I'll get this and a mark catalog and I'll mark whatever um, pages it is that these items are on. Give them a little rundown on it. You can even go in and print off the product sheet on what ingredients are in it. Some people are real picky about that. Look very professional about it. In a nice little letter, just thanking them for being part of the sample club. This will be something pretty generalized. Um, thank you for being part of my sample club. Please enjoy these samples I have included. Ultra Sexy Heart. This is the brand new cologne Avon's coming out with. Please wear it every single day and enjoy it. It's on sale. La 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 is the price. This is when you could get it. Um, same with the skincare. The benefits of having a great skincare regimen. Not sure what you're using now. Please take time to use these, the serum and the stay cream. Both of them are very complimentary. They're great for your skin. This is what they can do. I've you know included the sheet. Um, I'll be getting back to you within the next week or so um, let me know please pm me what you think of the products and in the meantime if you'd like to order any of them here is my website easy peasy so cool so i love the idea it's definitely something you have to stay on track of you definitely want to be on top of it you can add people then every month if you want to to your club so that you can start getting more people my whole stipulation is just like kind of paula said if they can't give me a review on it i'm not sending them samples you know, it's kind of real simple. We're all in this to make some money. We're all in this to have a business. I'm not going to have them put reviews on my page in case they don't like it. I don't want them saying, oh, just made my skin burn. Not looking for reviews like that. You never know. Don't know these people. So they're friends, but they're not personal friends. So they're going to send me the reviews. I'll use the reviews as I can. So I'll go in and say, this is our new ultra sexy hard it just came out i do have a few samplers that have tried this product they're in my sample club give it a poke so people ask what's the sample club in case they want to be part of it so you can keep their information for later and um and then tell them you know you know terry loved it and i'll tag her name in it if she loved it and then that way she'll see your name tagged to a post that she's in talking about what she might have said and she can then comment but yeah no, 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 no. I'm not going to have them put it on my wall without me first editing that or at least seeing what they put. You know, sometimes you just have to be smart. <laughs> you don't want any negative. You don't have to be worrying about it. Not that I can imagine what anybody would have anything bad to say about the product because it's absolutely wonderful. But people do have issues. Sometimes things don't agree with them. Sometimes they don't agree with their skin. They're not going to think before they put it on there. Oh, I had a bad rash from it or my neck broke out, or, you know. Not absolutely because of the product, just could be because of them, you know, and their skin tone or their skin issues or whatever it is. But that's how I'm going to put it together. And like I said, I don't have all the product yet because I want to get more samples to show you. But I'm going to use a simple envelope. I'm going to make sure that I have a letter inside attached. Yes, I'll be happy to post that when I get it done. I did not type up the letter yet. And um, invest in some little try cups. They come smaller than this happens to be what I have here for making jello shots just being honest, but they work well for samples too. <laughs> so I'm gonna put sample stuff in this, put the lid on it, seal it good. Also wanna make sure anything you make yourself put in a baggie, just in case it does happen to bust or something in here, you don't want it to get all over. Um, keep in mind too, I know when I mail items with the book, they're always like, anything perishable, usable, tangible, fragrant, I'm like, tell them no. I mean, you're not gonna, you know, this will be okay. I mail them all the time. I'm not mailing a hundred of them. So, but that's how I mail them. It's a little bit cheaper, but so that's what I'm doing again. Take advantage of the demo. I'll put some of the item numbers up at the bottom as soon as I edit the video for you and add that so that you can find them a little bit quicker. And I get, wish you all the luck with this. I love that everybody's trying it. I think it's a fabulous idea. I think it can really change the face of what your business is for 2016. And what's really nice about it is if you get good, 
do a video because that's what I'm going to do. I'll have the full size products in front of me. I will do a quick video about my sample club, about what my sample club members got to get even more people interested and in maybe wanting to be part of it. So I hope to have a very long list of people and then before I add them to the sample club, they just might start getting a book first. <laughs> so um, hope that helps. Hope it explains things a little bit better for you guys. Just wanted to throw it together real quick while I was trying to put things together in my office. And again, you have a fabulous new year and I look forward to even more videos soon. Thanks.